Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Script Rants Virtual College Fair. I'm so excited that you're here joining us today. My name is Eric Klein, and I'm an admission counselor at Willamette University. I work primarily with students all across San Diego County, along with other parts of California as well. So I think we should just dive right in and give you a little bit about Willamette. So just a few historical facts to start us off. We were founded in 1842. We're actually the oldest university in the West before Oregon was even a state. Uh, we're located in Salem, Oregon, the capital. We're about an hour south of Portland, about an hour north of Eugene. We are a four-year private liberal arts institution, and we also have three professional schools that support our undergraduate work, including our College of Law, the Atkinson School of Management, as well as the Claremont School of Theology, which will start all of their classes at our Salem campus this fall. For some numbers for you, there's about 1,800 undergraduate students that comprise our student body, along with 600 graduate students. There's over 50 academic programs that you could choose from, along with 66 different study abroad par partnerships that you could be a part of. One of those really unique ones is our partnership with the Tokyo International University, and that allows students to come over from Tokyo to our campus, and our students have the ability to go over to Tokyo as well. Beyond what you're going to be doing in the classroom, I think there's lots that Willamette offers outside of the classroom as well. On average, about two to three activities are each student participating in at any given time, and that could be clubs and organizations. We have a thriving outdoors program that's getting our students out hiking and exploring the different offerings of Oregon. We also have our music ensembles, our performing arts clubs, as well as 19 Division III varsity sports. And next fall, we'll actually be starting women's triathlon as well. We're one of the first institutions to start up a program like that. So we're really excited about that. Along with tr traditional Greek life with fraternities and sororities. And we even can guarantee your on-campus housing for all four years. To speak a bit about the application process, we are exclusively on the Common App. We have no application fee and we're also a test optional institution. So we try to keep it as easy as possible to ensure that the application process is pretty smooth. Pretty much just what the common application requires is what we require. And finally, here's some information about our financial aid as well. There's three main components that make up your financial aid package. That first will be our merit-based scholarships. This year, those ranged up to $27,000 a year. They're also renewable each year for you as long as you stay in a good academic standing. We do have some competitive scholarships as well. So there's some for debate, music, theater, and our STEM majors, along with some of the visual arts programs that we have. What's nice about those music and theater programs, you don't have to be a student participating in the program, the academic program, to receive the scholarship. And then finally, we do have our need-based aid as well, looking at estimated family contributions in terms of the FAFSA. Students are always really concerned about what my education is going to get me once I graduate. So I think it's important to think about all of the components that come about when it comes to decide where you're gonna go for college. So on average, each student's getting about $37,000 in financial aid. And even beyond your schooling, once you get into a career, you're looking at a mid-career salary of over $100,000. So our students are not only receiving a good academic grounding, they're also prepared for their future. I know this was a lot of information that was very quickly provided to you, but if you have any questions at all, please feel free to reach out to me. You can always email me here at ecline at willamette.edu. You can always give me a call as well, and that's my personal cell, so I'd be more than happy to help you at any given time. But thank you so much for sitting in and listening, and I hope you all have a good day.